The weather is frightening, the thunder and lightning seem to be having their way. But as far as I'm concerned, it's a lovely day. The turn in the weather will keep us together, so I can honestly say that as far as I'm concerned, it's a lovely day. And everything's okay. Isn't this a lovely day to be caught in the rain? You were going on your way, now you've got to remain. Just as you were going, leaving me all at sea. The clouds broke, they broke, and oh, what a break for me. I can see the sun up high, though we're caught in a storm. I can see where you and I could be cozy and warm. Let the rain pitter patter, but it really doesn't matter if the skies are gray. Long as I can be with you, it's a lovely day. Isn't this a lovely day to be caught in the rain? You were going on your way, now you've got to remain. Just as you were going, leaving me all at sea. The clouds broke, they broke, and oh, what a break for me. I can see the sun up high, though we're caught in a storm. I can see where you and I could be cozy and warm. Let the rain pitter patter, but it really doesn't matter if the skies are gray. Long as you can be with you, it's a lovely day. This is a great song because Irving Berlin wrote it back in 1935 for a movie uh, called Top Hat, I believe, uh, with Fred Astaire, who introduced it, singing it to Ginger Rogers, who was none too thrilled to be caught in the rain with him. Uh, there's a couple little things in here that I do, and it might be a little trickier song for some people, and especially beginners, And but this is not a thing to be afraid of. And that is, again, this is another one of those songs that has an F sharp minor seven, which if you use the finger, the finger number system, it, it's kind of a stretcher because there's a gap in between this, uh, in between your strings. So it's uh, two, four, two, four. It looks like that, in which you really can't see much because my fingers are spread all over the place. Maybe that's a better view. Two, four, two, four. And you can move this all around, make that same shape and practice it. But at this location, it's called an F sharp minor seven, as well as probably a bunch of other things, um, which could be doggone hard chord. That could be the name of it. Uh, eventually, it'll come very easily for you if you practice it. Uh, that There's an F sharp minor seven. The good part of it is, is the next chord then is a B seven, and, and you've already got this finger planted. Your, your pointer finger is planted on that uh, second string, um, or yeah, uh, fourth string, uh, second fret. So all you're gonna have to do is do a little pivot right here and leave that one on there and you have a bar and You're going to use your middle finger then to get your one two third third um, String third fret and that's your B7 So you're going from a F sharp minor 7, which is and Then you're gonna go to a D diminished which down here is a one two one two and then to an F sharp minor, which is, it's um, two, one, two open. Looks like this. Kind of like a G7 shape. Only moved up. That's an F sharp minor. 
Okay, so let's see if there's any other uh, unusual cords or strange cords in here. I don't think there are really. Those will be kind of your stretchers. And uh, the one other point that I will point out, and that is uh, in the section where it goes, um, and I'm looking quickly for it here, where it goes, um, oh, the clouds broke, they broke, and oh, what a break for me. It goes from an F sharp minor, which is that shape I just talked to you about, two, one, two, open, to a D7, the clouds. Now the D7 that I'm going to play there is what I would call the Hawaiian D7 or two finger D7. So you're gonna pick up this pointer finger and now you have two open, two open, and a lot of you may play your D7 that way. And this is the D7 that you'll wanna play there because it gives you that um, diminished sound that you want there kind of and kind of a dissonant sound there so it goes the clouds broke they and the next one up is a c diminished so you kind of have to pivot up a little bit broke and oh what a break for me now the one thing is in that phrase you could do f sharp minor seven to that d7 to an f sharp minor seven to that d7 again and it would go like this the clouds broke they broke and oh what a break for me but what happens here at least in my mind uh, harmonically it works okay there but what happens here is when you go to the c diminished at that other word broke it goes it, it lifts up your spirit because that's what's happening here uh, lyrically it goes the clouds broke starts to lift you up uh, musically through and through the lyrics so uh, C diminished works there but if you struggle switching from that right away you can play that other D7 of course as I say with all my song sheets these are not written in stone they're printed on paper right so this is a framework for you to do with what you want this is my arrangement this is how I'm going to probably play it although there's a few tweaks in here and maybe a couple things that I left off one being this when you bar your D, your D chord, which is barring at that second fret and throwing your pinky up on the fifth fifth fret first string, that's a D sub a D. And now what you can do is you can walk this down. I didn't put that on the diagram at all, and it will go like this. If you listen to this when I bar it, this is the intro now or that um, first verse. Isn't this a lovely day to be caught in the rain? Now here comes rain. Down to the D7. You were going on your way, now you've got to remain. Here comes that F sharp minor 7. Just as you were going, leaving me on. Now I'm, I'm kind of sliding my fingers down at uh, I'm making a different chord here, but I didn't diagram that chord. Leaving me all at sea. The clouds broke, they broke, and oh, what a break for me. Oh, I can see the sun up high. It's too fun not to quit, to quit it. Oh, I can see where you and I could be cozy and warm. Third time through, let the rain pitter patter, but it really doesn't matter if the skies are gray. Long as I can be with you, it's a lovely day. Have fun. It's a great day. It's a great song. Thank you, Irving Berlin, for writing these great numbers.